Alabama State Hospital for the Insane, also from what I gathered from a group of uh, locals, also known as the OG Bryce Hospital. Uh, opening in 1861, closing down in 1995. This place is now owned by the University of Alabama. Um, it doesn't seem like anyone cares that it's even back here, unfortunately. But um, a lot of destruction, a lot of vandalism. Let's get into it. Appears to be a three-story hospital with roof access. I did my walkthrough earlier. Upon getting here, there was another car that was pulling up the drive. Um, once I got to the beginning of the building, there was three teenage girls that were in the car and said that they were scared to come in and whatnot. But um, they call, the, apparently the local high schoolers call it the OG Bryce Hospital because there's another Bryce Hospital. So, but yeah. This is uh, given Saratoga County Homestead vibes. There's uh, not a lot left of almost anything. The structure's here, but the ceiling and the roof and everything is all caving in and pretty much gone for the most part. Every single window in here, there's not a single one that's not busted out. <clears throat> As you can see, just from the, just from the uh, first floor, all the way up on that wing of the hospital. And just debris from the ceiling and from the walls, the plaster, everything has just made the floor of the hospital look like, look like Hoth from Star Wars. A lot of destruction, a lot of vandalism. It's uh, more than I can really wrap my head around. I uh, am gonna answer everyone's question before it even gets dropped in the comments. Um, I've already had some activity just doing the walkthrough itself earlier. Just hear them walking, just hearing footsteps. I haven't seen anything, but I've heard a couple of things so far. kind of hard to tell you what rooms were what because everything is so gone I suppose that it's hard to kind of track that or figure it out but there is 
two other buildings on the property. I'm not sure if I'm gonna include those or not. Only because I have, I'm on a time crunch. So I'm not 100% sure just yet of what I'm gonna do. building and the nature that is coming through the floors and the windows and the ceiling have just made almost like natural art. They're all beautiful. <sighs> that might be the first thing that I've seen that is still intact as a tub. Sorry for the profanity on it. Not like I can do anything about it, but. And you can tell most of this was done by kids as far as the graffiti and vandaling, vandalism, vandaling <laughs> is concerned. Join me in hell, it says. Maybe it's talking about this, where the floor is just gone. It's another set of stair staircase right there. so much harder to walk through here probably than any other place I've ever been it's just so dilapidated Hardly any of the staircases are, you're even able to go up because of how bad it is. Maybe we'll get lucky with this staircase over here. Should I take my chances on the rickety fire escape? I'm gonna take that as a no. Probably not a good idea. poker chips and cards up here.
we've got two more floors to look at. We have the next floor and then we have the basement. sad too. Pretty much all destroyed. There's nothing left. Just the foundation itself, unfortunately. But let's go down and see the basement. The basement's tricky because it has, it's just like these steps, but it's worse. This one's way worse. And if I fall on camera, you guys have some interesting content to look at. <laughs> See, that one can't even get down. It's so peaceful out here. We have another building to go look at over here on this side. Let me know in the comments what your favorite part of this was. This um, place is absolutely insane. <clears throat> Hope you've all enjoyed it so far. This was the other, one of the other buildings that I was talking about. I'm not sure if these are stoves. Maybe this was the kitchen for the, uh, for the hospital. Uh, furnaces, I'm not 100% sure. But those down there look like stoves or maybe they were the uh, wood burners for the furnace that led to the building. Not 100% sure. Well, that's going to be it for our video. I hope you enjoyed everything. As far as I can tell, this place stays quiet. Just local kids come out and check it out and do whatever they do. But um, awesome place to check out if you get a chance. If you liked the video, make sure to subscribe, like, comment, and share out to your family, your grandma, your pappy, whatever the case. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Let's get into it.